Hi guys, Nixie here, back with another video and today we can have another review for the VAVA 4K Ultra Short Throw Laser Projector. This time it comes in a black color, it supports 3D and it have a few new features as well. So let's check it out, stay tuned. Welcome guys and thanks for tuning in. My previous video about the VAVA 4K laser projector was very popular and a lot of you guys like it. Since then, the VAVA released a new black edition of this projector and quite a few software updates along the way. So this projector now supports the 3D as well, which is very nice. Now let's do the unboxing and see how the black edition looks like and check what's new. Alright, this is the retail box of the VAVA 4K. On the top of the box we have the picture of the projector, so indeed it is the black edition. On the side we have the few printed specs, and on other side, model number, some more information and the list what is actually in the box. Now when you open the box, the first what you're gonna find is the information about registration, which will give you extended one year warranty, as well live support and early software updates. Next there is a quick start guide, which will tell you how to place your projector, how to pair remote control, how to adjust the screen, enable 4K 60 frames per second input, and etc. Next, in this envelope, we have the barcode for extended warranty. Next, we have the nice colorful user guide, printed in 9 different languages, which will tell you pretty much everything you need to know about the projector, how to set it up, and how to use it. Under the user guide, there is a small microfiber cloth for cleaning the projector lens. And there is a small box in which you will find the power cord, batteries for remote control, and the remote control itself. The remote control works on a Bluetooth and comes in a black color. It feels nice in the hand and it's very easy to use. Right under the protective foam, we are coming to the projector itself, which is wrapped in a plastic bag. I managed to remove protective bag and let's have a look on the projector itself. When it comes to design, this projector looks really nice and this new black matte color gives it even more distinctive look. All four sides of the projector are covered with a dark fabric, which gives projector very slick and modern look. On the front top side, right in the middle, there is a power button and a laser cover lens with a two infrared sensor on each side for eyes protection. Also, there is engraved VAVA logo and a few printed features on the left and right. Under the fabric, on the front side of the projector, there is a high quality 30 watt speaker setup by Harman Kartan. These speakers sound very good, they have a nice sound and they can go very loud. On the right side of the projector, there is an air intake grill with a dual 92mm cooling fans and a mechanical tilt adjustment. On the left side, we have the same layout with a 192mm exhaust cooling fan. On the back of the projector, there are three HDMI version 2.0 ports with the HDCP 2.2 compliance. Next we have the USB port, audio out, audio video out, optical out, gigabit LAN internet and the AC socket. There is also a Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth 4.0. One quick look under the projector and we can see the new ceiling mount brackets which VAVA added on the newest version of their projectors. For example my first VAVA 4K white model did not have the ceiling brackets. Also it's good to point that this projector comes with a universal voltage power supply and it will work with any AC voltage no matter where you live. Now in terms of setup, it's straightforward. Once you place projector on the TV stand and pair your remote control, set up your language, you will have the two options, projecting on the wall or projecting on the screen. Whichever option you choose, there is a nice guide with a text and images which is really nice. Now for those who have a projector screen, adjusting will be easy. Once you adjust the tilt mechanically on the side of the projector, there is an 8 point keystone screen adjustment and electronic focus which really helps you to fine tune and match your projector image with the screen. The VAVA 4K is a very bright laser projector. In the laser light source, it has a 20 laser diodes peaking at 6000 lumens pulling 360 watt in a high power mode so you can use this projector straight on the white wall in the medium illuminated room. But if you want absolute best picture quality and contrast in a daylight or in a higher illuminated room, 
you will need a special screen that is designed specifically for the ultra short roll laser projectors. Like this one for example. The screen that I use is the drop down 120 inch ambient light rejecting screen from the company named Vivid Storm. This screen is designed to block 95% of all lights that come from the ceiling and is designed specifically for the ultra short roll laser projectors. Combined with the right screen, the VAVA 4K unleashes full potential and you can have amazing picture quality even with the lights on. Now for those who missed my last review video for this projector, here are some specs. The VAVA 4K is an ultra short roll laser projector and it can project image in 4K up to 150 inches from a very close distance. It supports HDR10 with 3000 to 1 contrast ratio. It uses ALPD 3.0 laser light source technology, which have a 20 laser diodes in a light source rated with a screen brightness of 2500 NXE lumens. Color gamut is over 85% NTSC. It has a high quality built in Harmocart speakers, and it comes with a lifespan of over 25,000 hours, which means you can watch movies for 6 hours every day and it will last you more than a decade, which is very impressive. Now let's talk about the software and check what's new. The VAVA 4K used a custom version of the Android 7.1, which is a bit outdated, but in this application it runs very smooth and fast. Since my last review video, the VAVA released a few firmware updates for this projector and they add a few new features along the way. The latest software is the version 1.91 and here are some of the new features. For example, now you can choose which HDMI will be your boot source and when you turn on the projector, it will boot directly into the HDMI source that you choose, which is very useful and now you do not need to switch inputs to your external device each time when you turn on the projector, as it will do that automatically, which is very nice. Next, the CAC controls are fully working now and the projector can control power state of other devices. So next time when you turn on or off your projector, your Blu-ray player or receiver will turn on or off as well. If you have motorized screen, combined with a USB trigger, the screen will automatically drop down or retract as well, which is very nice. Next one is the added option for the refresh rate. So those who are using this projector to watch news programs, now you can choose between 50 or the 60 Hz refresh rate and match it with your country. These new options can fix and synchronize tiny delays in a picture and sound, which is very useful. The next feature is my favorite one, and that is the screen off mode. So now when you click on the power button on your remote, you can choose the screen off mode, which will give you option to listen to music without need to have projector screen on all the time. This way, not only that you save electricity, you also increase the lifespan of the projector, as you can listen to music all day long, without any stress on the projector light source. And now, we are coming to the most important new feature that comes with the software update since this projector came out, and that is the support for 3D. The VAVA 4K now supports the 3D, and with the DLP Active 3D glasses, you can enjoy in the 3D movies. Personally, I do not watch 3D that often, but I know that many people do. So I test this new feature on a few 3D movies just to see how the projector performs. After a few movies in 3D, I gotta say that the experience was very cool, and I did not have any eye strain or any issue with it. Between these three movies, the Pacific Rim was my favorite, and in my opinion, it looked awesome in a 3D. In fact, the whole experience on 3D on VAVA was very pleasant and quite of fun, so I might get a few extra 3D glasses in the future from my friends and family. Now, when it comes to the picture quality in 2D, the VAVA performs excellent and the picture quality is fantastic. Watching 4K content and movies on this projector is a real joy. The picture is bright, crystal clear and sharp, with a good contrast and deep black levels. Colors are nice and vivid, and the visual experience is awesome. For those who like to play with the picture settings, holding the right button on the remote will give you the few options and you can select between picture and color profiles. As well, you can customize each picture settings and color as well to match your preference. HDR videos and movies also look great. When you're watching online content on the projector directly or over external device, the projector will automatically apply HDR when the video supports it. Before, the smart YouTube app on the projector only supported 1080p, but now it supports 4K as well. 
so you do not need any external device to watch 4K YouTube videos. For the Netflix, on the other hand, you still need external device like an Android TV box or the Blu-ray player. For example, I'm using very affordable Sony 4K Blu-ray player, which supports 3D, HDR10 and the Dolby Vision as well. This player has a built-in 4K support for both YouTube and the Netflix, and I gotta say that I'm very satisfied how good the projector performs combined with this Blu-ray player. Also, it's good to point that no matter what external device you use, you should always give this projector 4K input even if you're watching some non-4K content. Giving the projector 4K input, the software will not apply video noise processing and you will get much better picture quality with 4K input instead of the 1080p. When it comes to the noise level, the Vava 4K is a pretty quiet projector and any content that you're watching easily covers the noise from the cooling fans. According to my non-calibrated sound meter, the noise level is around 37 decibel, but I believe there is more quieter than that. Also, it's a good to point that the Vava has no coil noise like other cheaper laser projectors. In terms of reliability in the long run, I'm happy to report that we still have the white version of this projector placed it in our living room, that we use as a TV replacement, that runs every day, all day long, for over a year now, without any issue and we are very satisfied with it. So in the end, what I think about the Vava laser projector? Well, with a great build quality and nice design, excellent image quality in a 4K, up to 150 inches, laser light source that can last over a decade, 3D support with a great speakers and 2 years warranty, the Vava 4K is a great laser projector and I recommend it to anyone who are looking for the nice and reliable home cinema laser projector. Alright guys, I hope that you liked this video and found it useful. Link of this projector, Blu-ray player and the projector screen you can find in the video description. And if you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave the comment. Thanks for watching and I see you next time. Bye bye. P.S. It feels good to be back.